morning world you find us in Kyoto in late mornings because we're going to queue for some ramen that's supposed to be very famous and shit around anyways uh, okay. it's coffee time and yeah then we're gonna head over there and hopefully there's like no queue we're quite early ish but you never know with like the good stuff we'll you never know. So nice. Alright, we have this and then which one are you getting? Okay, so you have to come in. was not bad but she thinks it's too salty <coughs> but I think it's not bad it's uh, too cold but she thinks it's too salty and okay but one thing that I have to say the wait is definitely not it's not worth that long a wait although we were like the second in line the mountain ramen is bad the mountain ramen that was in the previous episodes so check that out but right now we are at Kyoto's Pokemon Center which I have not visited before Let's do catch us about to attempt another mountain road this time uh, to go up Mount Hiei here in Kyoto and it's gonna be our last drive up the mountain road uh, this one's another toll based pathway is what they call it or driveway and uh, yeah let's go
to head to this observatory place by to look at Lake Biwa. Lake Biwa is like sort of like this massive ass lake uh, that's surrounded by I don't know land. That's what it's called lake. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah. So we we literally drove up Mount Hie and. Um, for this driveway thing and I guess the yesterday's to me yesterday's uh, uh, driving route is much more excitable compared to today's one for some particular reason but anyways here's the view And that's it. That's the end of uh, the this particular parkway drive. It's a, uh, again. I think it's not bad. It's more expensive than the other one. So the other one more worth it. Yeah, the other one's way more worth it, honestly. And it's more fun. This one's a little bit more challenging, more traffic. Yeah, but it it was still fun, nevertheless. I guess you know. And this is definitely the car to do it. You know. No more. We gotta return the car. Waiting for the person to, to, to get it. Back at Mercure, and this time around we've got a bigger room because we know it's the last few nights already, and the big room is awesome because look at this. Now, yes, the sink is still outside the toilet, but look at how big this room is. Again, harden the, the dimness. That's just uh, uh, how dim the, the hotel is. And we've got the fridge behind this glass here. Let me show you. Oh, there. It's a fridge, uh, microwave, this area here. And then, show you the toilets. Okay. This is where you take the shit. Okay. And then, this is where you shower. And washing machine. So technically this would be a good place to stay if you're planned for like a long trip in the middle if you like as well because you can wash one round of clothes. So hey that's the cool part about this room. Very lovely. Back in Osaka and we are going to Ikaku again because I like it. It's awesome. And we're gonna try it again. But this time around, we're gonna see if the Ikako here is nice as well. Is the same or not? Yeah, that's the that's the task.
Okay, we just cleared it. Now the verdict is because this time round we are able to try uh, uh, what's that? The, the adult, adult one. one. So this one is called Honetsuki Honetsuki Dori. That's the name of the dish. But within the dish, there is two different types. One is the Oyadori, which is the adult version. And then one is the Hinadori, which is the child version. So it's pretty much like an adult chicken and a, and a baby chicken. And not really a baby chicken, baby but like, chicken. Like a smaller, smaller chicken. Yeah. But go for the Hinadori. Because the Oyadori is unbelievably tough. Like, oh, it's yeah. so tough to chew and... Uh, Exactly. So I think, yeah, go for the oyadori. You know, no, the hinadori, the young one. All right, that's it for today. And uh, yeah, we are. I think we've got two more days in Osaka before we fly back. But yeah, thanks for watching. Remember, leave a comment, subscribe, and see you in the next one. Bye. Good morning world, we are at Nakao and I finally get my uh, hold on. It's not finally lah, this is like the second time in this trip where I'm having this place. Not enough, clearly that's the answer. So let's go for some awesome food. Nakao is awesome by the way. Okay. okay, so Osaka is famous for this Gogojiji Horai and uh, one has to try it because Chinese food You cannot take the Chinese out of the Chinese Okay, so how's the... Good? Life changing? Next level? Well, why is it good? Why is it different from... What? It's a meat feeling, right? It's pork feeling. But there's What's cabbage different? inside. Oh! Mm, cabbage or onion. I need onion. Okay, okay, okay. 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 Mm. Also, we did some shopping earlier on. I got no, not, not go with you. Alright, look at that! Bape! Bape! Eating the pao. <laughs> I couldn't really film inside some of these stores so I think for these last few days I'll probably uh, merge the vlog episodes together we'll probably not do like so many vlog filming but just some clips here and there, randoms perhaps so I was eating this, yeah Hmm It's alright no, two for four twenty. Mm. Does not taste like China. Then I can tell you, it's Japanese China, J J China, J China. The bun is red. Yeah, the bun is different. Yeah, maybe that's the, that's also another. It's like how their bread here is different, but yeah, I don't know. Try it. Try it. Last day of the trip. You, you're not catching us in the morning because we went out a little and we have so much baggage. And uh, most of the places we went, some of the places we went, they don't allow like filming inside it as well. But anyways, we are in a swanky. I think this is Elfart or Veilfire. Uh, got us an airport transfer, which is a good way if you have a ton of baggages and stuff. And I love how they are. There's a TV in the car. Or rather, they can tune in to the telly. Which is pretty cool. Watch your Sunday baseball. Yeah. Which is pretty cool. It's 
F1 going on now though. I gotta check on the status of the race later. But yeah, this is gonna be uh, a comfortable ride to the airport. I love these seats. Thank you. 